Hey everyone, today I'm gonna to show you how to move objects in Procreate. Okay, so I've done this illustration, but I have it all on the same layer. So if I click the mouse and I try to move it, it's only gonna move every single asset on that layer, but I don't want that. I only want to move one of these little illustrations. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click this button up here, the selection tool that looks like a letter S. And there's a couple different ways that we can select an object to move it. So we have automatic, freehand, rectangle, and ellipse. So automatic, if it's checked on like it is now, you just tap on a object and it will select it. And so if I go over here to the mouse, you can see it automatically selected it. So let's go back over here. You can also do freehand, which is when you take your Apple Pencil you draw around an object and click the mouse and that selects it as well. And then you can do a rectangle where you draw with your Apple Pencil a rectangle around something, click the mouse and that selects it in a rectangular form. And then you can do ellipse, which is where it draws a circle around something and you can select it that way. But for today, all we're going to do is do automatic. Okay, so I'm gonna click this little life raft. And now I'm going to click the mouse. And in order to move it, all you have to do is take either your Apple Pencil or your finger, I'll show you how to do both, and just drag it. And because I had magnetics turned on already, it's trying to magnetize to the horizontal and vertical axis. So I'm gonna turn that off just so I can be a little bit more precise if I wanna move it inward or outward. And then, like I said, you can use your finger as well. And that's all you have to do to move an object. Thanks so much for watching.